If you want to be able to buy the most expensive players and open the best packs in FC24, go to u7buy.com to buy your EA FC24 coins. It's cheaper than buying FC points and just as reliable. With their already amazing prices, you can get an extra 6% using promo code INCEPTION at checkout. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, today we have a new custom tactic uh, to go ahead and review. This custom tactic is going to be for the 4321. Uh, usually I'll just tweet out sometimes like, hey guys, what tactics are you enjoying? I don't, I as a content creator don't usually stay on a tactic once I've reviewed it, but I know which ones are like really good. You know, like the 4222 right now after the patch, in my opinion, is probably the best formation. Um, I've been enjoying it the most. I think it's really, really important to have like the two CDMs and the two strikers with, 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 with <laughs> the side players, right? Um, so that's why I've created like, or, or created reviews for two different variations of it, where one is the Naweezy one, which is really good. And then the one that we reviewed from George recently as well, right? But this 4321 uh, was basically someone just replied to me and said, hey, you know, you could check out Crystal Ace's 20 and 0 custom tactics. Um, I know that this guy is a competitive player just because of the way that his team looks. Guys, you know what we need to stop doing in the FIFA community? We need to stop saying you only get these results because of this team. We need to stop saying this because if you guys actually play foot champs and you get to a point where, you know, your wins are looking pretty good in foot champs, you are also going to be facing people that have insane teams. So you're it's insane team versus insane team. Like, I don't know why people keep doing this, especially at this point in the year, right? It's it, let's can we be real? It comes from a place of jealousy when you don't have that team, right? Like, look, we're going to be honest. OK, anyways. I'm not even protecting myself because I don't have a full meta team on any of my accounts. I just have the SBC account and there's so many icons and stuff that I don't even have because, again, we don't even grind on it, right? But just trying to explain to you guys that, like, people, they can get those results. They have a team, sure, but other people will also have the teams. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, this team I see here, guys, I do reviews in Foot Champs. I face the, this sort of team sometimes in Foot Champs. Like, I would say, like, at least every weekend, six times, at least six times dude so i don't know people keep doing this i don't know what it is right but i already know that this guy is a full meta rat we're talking like for me i i play at a rat capacity because if you play this game by default you, you gotta be a rat let's be real right i say my rat capacity is at like 65 percent, 70 percent, maybe you know if i surpass that that's when my mental brain cells will start to be lost you know i know that he definitely plays this way because look at the players that he has he 100 percent plays to the meta of working for Ariel. That's what it is, right? Because there's the the competitive, the pro player meta where they cross the ball to the far post, right? Especially with people that have the whipped pass plus. He's got the Kafu card. You already know how it is, right? And whipping it to the guy to the far post, not even to score a header every time, but to pass the ball because the Ariel plus works with... Honestly, the Ariel plus is more noticeable for the passing than it is for the actual goal scoring. It's actually really crazy, right? They, they basically cross the far post, pass it back into the middle, and then go for a strike because it's a very park the bus meta, right? Um, but the custom tactics for this, to be fair, it does, regardless of that meta being a thing and him clearly doing it, to be fair, right? Uh, which is... You know, it's a good tactic. Like attacking AI wise, it's pretty good. Like we did, we did end up scoring like a few decent goals because of the movement actually being pretty nice, right? Uh, so the tactic is lined up like this: uh, 32 for width, 72 for depth, balanced direct passing, 50 for width, five for players in the box, two for corners, two for free kicks, right? The instructions on the team is like this: so the striker is on stay central. Right, striker stay central. Your left forward is stay central, come back in defense. Early on with the aerial plus, he even has Peter Crouch on the other side. You know what I'm saying? Uh, stay central, come back in defense. Your right forward is stay central, stay forward. Uh, your right center mid, the attacking oriented midfielder that can be an actual midfielder or an actual attacker. Preferably, it should be an actual attacker. Reason being for this is because you want to be able to switch to another formation if you need to, right? So for instance, uh, with this team that he has here, he can easily switch to a 4 triple 2 if he wants to. It's He's not going to because he wants to play to that meta, right? But it, he, it's something that he can do, right? You always need to have those four attackers with the two midfielders, right? Um, so he has that guy on just balance. You don't touch anything, right? Uh, the guy down the middle, as usual, stay back while attacking cover center. Uh, the left center mid is on just cover center. So this guy could actually get involved in the attack, right? Um, 
In his case, he has Rude Hullet, which, again, is a guy that offers physical presence pushing forward too, right? So um, could definitely be really nice there too. Uh, left back, he has Rolfo, who's on the overlap instruction. And then for the right back, it's on stay back while attacking overlap. And I think for his goalkeeper, he doesn't touch. No, balance, balance for the goalkeeper, right? So Vanessar being one of the better goalkeepers in the game, definitely very solid. Uh, I still think Czech is that guy. That team of the year Czech card is really good, but it, Vanessar is obviously still a very good choice as well. He's got good saving animations. He only has one saving animation when it's directly at him sometimes. It's like very inconsistent, right? Uh, but yeah, still a pretty decent goalkeeper. The new traits they gave him, he has like the rush rushes at a goal. It's pretty good. Like he could actually put that as an instruction. It'd be pretty solid to work with when it comes to Vanessar, right? But um, yeah, that's pretty much it in regards to how the custom tactic is lined up. So yeah, that's uh, that's the introduction. Types of players, pretty self-explanatory as usual. You want two proper midfielders. You you can see this is what I was trying to tell people with the true of many card, right? Some people don't want to have that like medium high work rate player anymore however true many is still very very solid right more solid if you play like a four two three one four triple two uh cdm position stay back cover center cut passing lane like that intercept is really really noticeable and he offers very good physical capabilities in the defensive uh midfield positions right but you can see that he's using the higher tier ones which is like jude bellingham holid some people will go with the lower tier ones which would be or quote unquote lower tier not lower tier i'm saying like price wise right you would go with uh rolfo and the other midfielder i mean like some people might do like a gunduan a yasuo kimmich right but it, it, they're smaller players you can see that he's using these two because they're bigger taller more physical players right they they definitely fit the meta a little bit more but like players like uh rolfo like i've i've used chua many next to rolfo and even that midfield situation is really nice but listen if you want to play to that full meta capacity, which is brainless, let's be real, okay? Then sure, you can do the whole crossing to the far post, use aerial plus, pass the ball back, blah, 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 right? Go ahead. That's kind of like how the formation set up, to be honest, right? But um, if you also want to just play for good, authentic attacking AI with the 4-3-2-1, this will still give you a good option, all right? Guys, hopefully you guys enjoy this video today. I'm going to show you that as a highlight, and I'll catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. We'll see what's up for content today for the new Golossal team. Okay, good build up play. Oh, he even tries to go for the far post there, and I still get it. Eat that rat. Park that bus, you little loser. Okay, bro, you're parking that bus. I'm going to break that bus. Don't worry. Even with all this emphasis, I will break it. You little rat. I will break it, you little rat. Vamos, rat. Vamos, rat. Let's go on the lay. All right. There we go. Nice finesse shot. There it is. Wara finesse shot.
Ah, almost. Almost, almost. All right. We're scoring all the FIFA cheese goals. That's why the goals in this game are valueless. The game could be 5-0. It's just, ooh, you know, we just we just play for the sake of it, boys. That's what it is, man. There it is. Oh, I deserved, man. There it is. Good play, good play. Oh, that side-footed one. Oh my goodness, that one just scares me, dude. There we go. There is a space. That's what we're looking for. There it is. That's a penalty, but sure. And I also shot the ball, but he went for control instead, so... There is also that. There it is. There it is, get that finesse shot. Let's go, Charlton. Oh, that worked out. That was a bad pass by me, too. Penalty. Okay, I was about to say. I saw him pushing towards me. I was like, I gotta do some extra stuff here. Gotta do some extra stuff. I'll be Charlton. Charlton. And it's a goal. A very good. A very good. Let's go, Pires. Nice. Good finish, good finish. Bobby Charlton. Charlton, the based. There he goes. Oh, we're just going to chip it. And we get it. Very nice. The Hawk giving him the, the, the physical boost is definitely helpful for sure, too. Like, in a situation like that, it's helpful, right? So... There we go. Oh, I thought you were still going to block it. I'm like, please, bro, relax, bro, relax, please. I was going to hold the whole time there, so. First time. There it is. We're good, bro. We're good. Just gotta mark that area well enough. Little through ball. 
There we go. Oh yeah, Charlton, that's what I'm looking for. You can't do that to the Perez. Relax, buddy. Takares. Takares, bro. Takares. Can't be doing that to them, bro. There it is. Very nice. Let's go, Francesco Lee. There it is. Oi. And sure. Oh, and he tackles the guy. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. There it is. There we go. Oh, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. Yes. 